Well, time is ticking to get your solar eclipse glasses. You might already have yours, but be careful. Doctors are warning against using the wrong ones. In fact, two different optometrists raise concerns to us about glasses handed out here in Toledo. Those optometrists say the glasses are missing something very important. So we wanted to dig into it and find out more. There is a lot of Oh, copycats, I would say, out there. There are a lot of options when it comes to solar eclipse glasses, and all the choices can be overwhelming. From different colors and designs, there are paper, plastic, but that shouldn't be your number one concern. The side of the glasses will always have that it has the ISO requirement, so it's the ISO 12312 on it. That's Dr. Angela Jackson, an optometrist who has an office in Rossford. She noticed the glasses handed out by Destination Toledo were missing that ISO certification. Destination Toledo showed us documentation which they claim shows the glasses are ISO certified. It's just not on the actual glasses. The glasses also do not have any instructions, warnings, or safety information printed on them. Destination Toledo gave us a statement reading, Sourcing solar eclipse viewing glasses is an important part of the solar eclipse experience, and one Destination Toledo takes very seriously. Regardless of where glasses are obtained, it's crucial to verify their safety through specific home tests recommended by the American Astronomical Society. Without that stamp of approval, you have no way of knowing and unless you're looking at the sun and you don't want to do that experiment. If your glasses don't have the ISO certification, those at-home tests could come in handy. Those are also suggested by the American Academy of Ophthalmology. They involve trying eclipse glasses on inside and looking around. You should only be able to see very bright lights, but those lights should be dim through the glasses. We tried that with the glasses handed out by Destination Toledo and didn't notice much of a difference between them and other glasses that do have the ISO certification on them. So while ultimately it's a personal choice on which glasses to choose, eye doctors have a warning. Solar retinopathy, it can happen just after a second of viewing it to multiple seconds, and it could lead to either just a little bit of damage to your vision for just maybe a couple weeks to a month or permanent. A third optometrist we spoke with tells us he doesn't completely trust any paper glasses. He said if you just stare at it for the sun for a few minutes at a time, then you'll be in trouble and could damage your retina no matter what you're wearing. If you want more details on how to check the effect effectiveness of your glasses, we have information from the American Astronomical Society available on our website.